This is ABC's World News Now. Hello to our fans online, I'm Devin Dwyer. And I'm Michelle Franza with the top stories on this Monday, August 11th. 24 people stranded on a roller coaster have been rescued from a loop 70 feet up near the top of the ride. They were stuck in an upright position for about five hours at Six Flags Amusement Park in Largo, Maryland. Firefighters handed out food, water, even umbrellas for shade from the sun until they could be brought down safely. There were no major injuries. Still plenty of questions this morning about the weekend's car racing tragedy in upstate New York. That left one young driver dead. 20-year-old Kevin Ward Jr. crashed Saturday night in a small dirt track race. He jumped out of his car and was pointed in the direction of three-time NASCAR champ Tony Stewart. Stewart's passing car struck Ward, killing him. Now to a history-making little leaguer from Philadelphia, 13-year-old Monet Davis struck out six batters yesterday in a complete game shutout. It means her team will be going to the Little League World Series, where Monet will be just the 17th girl to take part in that event. And you may have heard of hog calling, but husband calling? Well, here's the winner of the <laughs> Illinois State Fair husband calling competition. My husband's name is Francis O'Reilly. <laughs> that was Cheryl O'Reilly. Condolences to her husband, Francis. The men had to have something to do, too, so they participated in, of course, the hog calling contest. That's what you're listening to right now. The winner is that guy. His name's Chris Carr. So congratulations to the both of them. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Devin Dwight. And I'm Michelle Franz, and thanks for watching. This is ABC's World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. More Americans choose ABC News to see the whole picture.